Hey everyone, let's talk about spark plug tube seals. Like all rubber components on the S2000, the spark plug tube seals will eventually fail and when they do you'll know because you'll be able to find oil in your spark plug tubes or on your ignition coils. If the spark plug tube seals aren't replaced soon enough, the spark plug tubes can continue to fill with oil and eventually lead to misfires. Fortunately, replacing them is pretty simple, let's get to it. The first thing you want to do is remove the valve cover. If you need help doing that, I've got videos that will be linked down below. Once the valve cover is removed, flip it upside down and set it down on a workbench. Now you've got to remove the old spark plug tube seals. Use a hammer to drive a flathead screwdriver between the seal and the seal seat on the valve cover. Then twist the flathead screwdriver to crush the seal and use the screwdriver to pry the edge of the seal away from the valve cover. Repeat this process for the other seals. With all the old seals removed, you can now install your fresh new seals. Lightly coat the seal and the seal seat inside the valve cover with some oil. Place the seal on top of the seal seat with the round side pointed upwards like so. Inserting the seals the wrong way seems to be a mistake that people commonly make. Once the seal is correctly in place, gently hit it into place with a rubber mallet. Make sure that the seal is evenly pushed into place. Repeat this process for the other seals. With the seals in place, all you have to do is reinstall the valve cover. But before you do, you might want to clean up your spark plug tubes if they have oil inside them. Start off by removing each spark plug from the cylinder head with a spark plug socket and an extension. With the spark plugs removed, you'll have to fabricate some sort of long and thin cleaning device that will reach the spark plug seat. I decided to use a shop towel wrapped around the oil dipstick. I've read of other people taping shop towels around screwdrivers and extensions. I was able to insert my fabrication into the spark plug tube and gently rub it around the spark plug seat to pick up some oil. After you're satisfied with your cleaning job, you'll have to reinstall the spark plugs. Use a spark plug socket and an extension to tighten each spark plug. Torque them to 24 foot-pounds. Now you can finally reinstall the valve cover. If you need help doing that, I've got videos that will be linked down below. One thing that you'll have to be mindful of is that the new seals might need some assistance stretching and fitting around the spark plug tubes. If you notice yours are having trouble, gently push the seals down with your finger. If you found this video helpful, smash that subscribe button and feel free to leave a comment about a topic you'd like to see covered in the future.